Hi, today I thought I'd share with you a Goose Creek haul of some items I picked up not too long ago. I made several purchases in the month of April and early May, and so this is part of my first purchase. And it's just, for this video, I just have one apothecary jar, a large three-wick jar, several lotions, a soap, and a couple of different wax melts. So I'll try to keep it quick might give you kind of an overview of these items in case you're interested in maybe picking them up yourself. So the first thing I got here for this video is an apothecary style jar called Coconut Cherry Macaroon. This smells so good. The scent notes of this candle are cherries, macaroon, macaron, excuse me, not macaroon, but macaron and toasted coconut. So it does the first thing you think of when you smell this is the smell of a French macaron, which is primarily almond meal with confectioner's sugar and egg whites. So it's no surprise that you would smell almond, like an almond meal when you first open it up. There's also a hint of toasted coconut, and then in a moment you start to smell the cherry. But all this is on cold, and so I hope that, and I bet that when I when I burn it, and the wax pulls out, I'm going to really get more of that cherry scent. But even on cold with that almond and coconut and just the subtle hint of cherry, it smells so delectable and beautiful. I absolutely love it. I also love the look of the candle with this gorgeous like light pink wax. Can you tell from my lighting? Beautiful, just a lovely looking candle with this lovely light pink wax and these pretty pictures of these French macarons right there on the front. These pink macarons, so, so delicate and pretty. I love this candle. Can't wait to burn it. Uh, the next candle I got is called Beach Dreams. <clears throat> And it was on sale. I think this might have been $12.99 when I bought it several weeks ago. And I think this was $11.99. Um, but it's called Beach Dreams. And um, the scent notes in this candle include sandalwood, vanilla, and soft jasmine. But I mostly get, at least on cold, because I haven't burned it yet, it's a really strong, rich sandalwood and vanilla scent. It's very sensual, very gorgeous. It's, it's just beautiful. I don't know. It just reminds me of summer, and for some reason, I don't know why. Uh, it just does. Uh, this this label helps, though. Like when I look at the label and then smell the candle, it kind of puts me in mind of summer. Um, I love that. I recently bought me a beach cruiser bike. I don't live near a beach, but it's I bought that style of bike. So that kind of kind of attracted me to the candle when I was just online looking at different candles and then when I read the scent notes I knew that I would like it but I love that label you got the beach cruiser bike with the sand and the ocean and a little bit of a outcropping in the background and it just smells so much like summer I love it and um, now that was from the first purchase and then because I love the scent of this candle so much a few weeks later, I went online and bought the same scent, but in a lotion and a soap. So <laughs> I did get the Beach Dreams soap, which I haven't opened yet. Um, I love that pretty blue color of the soap, and I love the, the label with that cool looking bike. And then here's the lotion, and I have experimented and used the lotion. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. It has that vanilla sandalwood scent. It's very light. And again, the lotion is such good quality. It sinks into your skin well, real well. So I love it. So basically, I have this in my kitchen. So I have the candle along with the soap. Kind of similar color scheme there. And the lotion in my kitchen. So that's sort of my summer theme to my kitchen this year. <laughs> and Kitty says hi. Okay. The next item I bought, and again, I've had this for like three weeks now, and you can see I've used it already, and I brought it to work and shared it with my coworkers. Everybody loves this. This is black, what's it called? Black Amber Plum. I swear, this if this came in a perfume, I would snatch it up in a heartbeat. <laughs> and I, I didn't even think to check it out, but I saw this video, another YouTuber um, that she put this in a Goose Creek candle haul. She bought this lotion and was talking about it. And as she described it, I thought, I have to get my hands on that candle. Well, the candle has been out of stock since then. And it's even today, um, I, it's 
early May or mid-May, I guess. Uh, and if you go on the Goose Creek website, the candle and wax melts are out of stock, but you can get the soap and lotions. So maybe they'll bring this out in the fall because it kind of is sort of a fall-like fragrance, but it's so gorgeous. The fragrant notes are sweet plums, black amber, vetiver, and patchouli. And it's so cool because you definitely smell the plum in this lotion, in the scent. You smell that sweet plum, but then there's the central, gorgeous sort of background note of the amber and the patchouli and the vetiver. Um, but what's really interesting, I mentioned earlier that I took this to work and wore it to work, and, and I got so many compliments on this lotion. You know, you would think that maybe this is a niche or niche kind of scent that not everybody would like but it seems in my experience to be universally liked <laughs> so anyway I love it and as soon as the candle and the wax melt come in stock I'm gonna snatch those up and um, I kind of feel like I want to get another lotion so that I don't run out of this because I've been using it really sparingly until I filmed this video but um, I, I definitely want to to get more of that it's just it's a gorgeous scent um the next thing i got is well the kitty kitty's in the way in the way beanie i have a lotion and a wax melt in the same scent and it's perfect day and i hope that you can see the labels they're so gorgeous and beautiful i wanted to try out the scent first before i bought the the candle i think they still have the large jar candle available I think they have the in the apothecary style I love it I absolutely love this so the next time there's some good sales going on and I and I want to make a purchase I hope to get this in a in a apothecary size candle but it's called perfect day and I'll read you the scent notes they include um, warm amber creamy sandalwood brushed suede and light musk so it's kind of like the that last lotion i talked about the amber plum it's a very sensual and warm it's got musk and sandalwood in it and um um suede and amber it's just warm and beautiful and gorgeous um yeah and but it also it also feels delicate. I don't want to say I don't want to use feminine or masculine one way or the other. I'll just say it smells warm and luscious, sensual and delicate at the same time. And I think it fits this like this label fits the scent notes so perfectly in my opinion. The wax is white, like oops, like a white wax. And um and it, it too, the, the wax melts come in a, a lovely packaging with a really, really pretty um, label on it right there. So again, I really am looking forward to at some point picking up the candle because I love, love, love the smell of this, uh, of this perfect day. And I've got one more thing to share with you. Um, and that is a, another wax melt. And this one is called Love Letters. And the reason why I picked up this one is because when I went online, the first thing I noticed was how pretty the label was. And I saw that they had peonies on there. And I love, love, love peonies. As far as florals, that's my favorite floral scent. So I decided to give it a try. So I bought the wax melts. The wax melts were on sale for $4. Very pretty, delicate pink. I don't know if you could tell, but a pretty pink, a delicate pink shade. And here's the... Here's the uh, here's the label, and I, I believe this is also in the apothecary style jar with the same beautiful, gorgeous, lovely label. I wrote down the scent notes. Let's see, the scent notes of this are peonies, lily, and white woods. I mostly get peony. It's a real soft, gorgeous, lovely peony scent. So if you like the smell of peonies, you probably would love this candle or this wax melt. So anyway, that's it for this uh, video. Um, I have another purchase that I was going to put in video. Um, just kind of share with you. So I'll do that probably in a day or two. But anyway, thanks so much for watching this video and take care.